Yes, I will take attendance. Okay, how are you? Fine? Yes, okay. Josefina, Guillermina, here or not here? Daniel, Rodrigo, Benicio, Maximo, Mia, here, not here, remember here, not here, and Camila, here. Yes, okay. Well, um, quiero felicitarles por los videos, ¿sí? Todos los que mandaron, la verdad que estuvieron súper divinos, súper eh, entretenidos para la corrección, nada para nada aburrido porque cada uno le puso su eh, edición, le puso su onda, ¿sí? ¿Está? Entonces, vamos a analizar. We are going to analyze the mistakes, yes, the mistakes of the video, very quickly, ¿ok? So, uh, do you know in the classroom, in the Google Classroom, you have the video and you have the comments here on the right, yes? So, I want you to read. Many of you has, has um, answer. Yes, and they say, okay, teacher, thank you. Yes, they have answered. Yes, okay, you have answered. But many of you haven't yet. So, the first thing I want you to do for this class is to have a look at the mistakes that are in your video. Yes, and the comments. Yes, because we have corrected the pronunciation mistakes and the grammar mistakes. Okay, so if you have grammar mistakes, we have already corrected the grammar, okay? For example, for plus ing, don't forget the s's, yes? But if you have pronunci if you have pronunciation mistakes, I put check your pronunciation mistakes in the online dictionary. So you are going to uh, write it there and you are going to Google on any online dictionary and for example, you are going to put this word, cough, that was one of the main mistakes, yes, and you are going to click on the pronunciation, cough, 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 any other one, yes, okay, okay, do you understand, you have the British pronunciation, cough, and the American pronunciation, yes, and depending on the person, I have already written all your grammar mistakes, yes, and uh, pronunciation mistakes. And it's very important that you see your mistakes. In this way, there is going to be a feedback. It means that I correct and you check the mistakes. Remember, if you don't check your mistake, okay, we are not going to advance, okay? For example, we have... Uh, grammar mistakes, yes, for example, advices, yes, advice, esto no borro porque necesito para después, así que seguimos aquí, no hace falta que ustedes copien esto porque cada uno tiene sus errores, ok, yes, anotado ahí, el que quiere lo puede pasar a la carpeta de inglés, mejor si lo pasan, no el que quiere, lo pasan a la carpetita, cada uno su um, grammar mistakes, yes, and um, pronunciation mistake. Advice is una palabra que nunca lleva S. It's singular. So you can say a piece of advice, a piece of advice. Yes. You can say a piece of advice. Yes. Like this. Se me viene. A piece of advice. Two pieces of two pieces of advice, All right? Is it clear? So you can say, I will give you a piece of advice or I will give you advice, some advice, okay? But never with the S, all right? Is it clear? So this, is, this was one of the grammar mistakes, all right? Then we have, um, yes, it's come back, come back from, a place. So you come back from a place. Yes. Pay attention, Camila. Estos son tus errores. Yes. Okay. El resto presta también atención. Yes. Okay. Come back from a place. Yes. At the moment. At the moment. Yes. And then you have other uh, pronunciation mistakes. For example, like 
public instead of public, yes, okay, public places, okay, so I'm going to explain the grammar mistakes, so at home you will use your online dictionary and you will check the pronunciation mistakes, okay, it's very easy, okay, Rodri, virus, repeat, virus, yes, okay, the coronavirus, then the same mistake, cough, cough, yes, okay, one person, and remember, which is the plural of person? Yes, very good, Rodri. People, yes, okay. Well, uh, whenever you give uh, an imperative, for example, you can say, uh, you can give an advice, you should go, you should stay at home, yes? You shouldn't go to public places. But if you put the imperative, You don't put blah, blah, blah. The subject doesn't go there, all right? Yes? So it's put or don't put. Yes? Clean your hands or don't clean your hands. Okay? Is it clear? Yes? So you can say, you can give an advice like this. Shooting, the modal verb plus infinitive or go to school. Don't go to school, the imperative, the order, all right? Yes? Uh, instructions also was one of the um, pronunciation mistakes. Then you have Josefina, yes? Okay? Distance, the accent is there. Distance, yes? Okay? Then uh, spread, the virus will spread. This is the correct pronunciation. You check the pronunciations is there, yes? But by the way, okay, then you have soup, that is sopa, and this is jabón, soap, soup, soap, yes, check there, in the online dictionary, all right, yes, very good, the videos, Jose, it was a very nice video too, yes, okay, all of, all of your videos, and, uh, let's say thank you to your parents because parents uh, were helping at home yes okay okay Guillermina, the same with advice yes i have already explained and then you have alcoholic yes use alcohol and then you have alcoholic and if you put the alcoholic word it goes with alcoholic drink for example yes alcoholic drinks and then the other pronunciation mistake was sneeze <laughs> sneeze yes um, mm, mm. well defenses también era una palabra que necesitaban que era para las defensas y eso okay um mia the same is say come comes from yes comes from yes uh, we can stop we can stop this. Si pongo el this acá, tiene que ir el sustantivo, a noun. We can stop this virus. Or we can stop it. All right? Is it clear? Yes, so don't forget, whenever you put this, it needs a noun. All right? Well, infected people or sick people. Yes, okay, en vez de con enfermos. Yes, okay. A uh, Benicio, muy bien la dinámica del, del video, super dinámico, perfecto. Yes, and you need, uh, the di um, you need to know the difference I have already explained before, the different in pronunciation between soup, I will bring some soup, the sopa, is soap, the jabón, yes, cough. The word you need was tissues. Tissues son las descartables, las los pa eh, pañuelos descartables. And the other, los que son de, de tela, handkerchief. This is the pronunciation, all right? Yes. Board, yes. Fruit. And then, you know, you have another, another person for the singular. The other people, yes. Okay. Ya lo hemos tratado en otras clases a este mistake, so pay attention. The teacher route is very strict, yes, strict, 
was the word that you needed, okay? Estricta, exigente, yes? Yeah? Strict. Then you have relax, yes? Yeah? And want to. Remember, when you use want to plus infinitive, is it clear? Yes? You don't need to copy, yes? Porque se me va a decir, ay, mi tiche va muy rápido, ya borró todos los mistakes. These mistakes, yes, are there in the Google Classroom to each student, yes? Okay, each of you has their mistakes on the right, but pay attention. If you need to, to know the other mistakes, rewind, yes? Okay, and put, put pause. So let's go very quickly to the classes. This was as regard the mistakes, yes, from the video, yes? So today, we are going to analyze the mistakes. We have already done this, and we are going to go to morals, ING forms, yes? Uh, then we are going to work with these pages from the class book, yes? Se la van a tener ustedes a esto, la foto. And we are going to do the homework, okay? So, now I want you to uh, open your notebooks, please. Open your yeah. notebooks, open your notebooks, yes? Yeah. And we are going to see a picture there, okay? Can you open your notebooks? Yes? Okay, I want you to put the date on pages 21, listen, 22, 23, and 24, all right? Are you there? Quickly, come on. Yes, okay, 21, 22, 23, and 24. Are you there? Are you there? Okay, good. Well, do you put the date in all the pages? Remember to put the date in all the pages. It doesn't matter, yes? It doesn't matter if you are at home, okay? Good. So pay attention now. Yes, are you there? Page 21. I want you to do exercises 1, 2, and 4, okay? So let's go to exercise 1 first. It says, look at the photo, and I have an, a photo here, yes, of a competition, yes? And if you don't know how to pronounce this word, triathlon. 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 Yes. Triathlon. Triathlon. Yes. You will look in the online dictionary. Get used to work. Yes. There. Get used to working there. Okay. Nos acostumbramos a usar el diccionario online también, eh, en casa. Yes, super fácil. Yes, okay. So, what have you got in the picture now? At home, yes, you have the same picture here. ¿Se ve bien, David? Yes? Mm -hmm. Okay? <coughs> this is the picture that you have at home. And I have already put a picture here about what? About a competition. And this is an important competition, yes? That is run. Where? Where do you think they run this competition? In Hawaii. Yes? And look, you have to cycle, you have to swim, swim first, cycle, yes, oops, you have to uh, swim, it's alive, okay? So you have to cycle, cycle swim, cycle, and then run, Yes? So, do you think you can run this competition? Do you think it's very difficult? It's very hard? What do you have to do to arrive at this competition? Yes? You have to train. What else? Many hours, of course. Yes? And what about the uh, uh, food you eat? What about what you drink? You have to be healthy, of course. What things you have to do to lead, yes, to arrive, yes, at this kind of competitions, okay? So, think about this, yes, and pay attention on the things you should and shouldn't do. Great. Yes, okay. Pay attention at home on the things uh, a competitor should and should should and shouldn't do, well, the thing they should do, yes, 
to run this kind of competitions, okay? Yes? Okay. Well, so let's go to uh, number two. Yes? So at home, do number one because this is the talking. Yes? Pause the video and talk about the things they uh, should and shouldn't do. Okay? Yes? Well, um, pay attention now. I want you to go to exercise two. We are going to do the listening, all right? So we have to listen to someone talking about a photo and answer the questions. Are you ready? Yes? Okay? Read the questions first, okay? Track nine. Unit two opener. An Ironman competition has three different races. In the swimming race, the competitors swim for 3.86 kilometers. Then they cycle for 180 kilometers. And finally, they run a marathon at the end. The world final of the Ironman championship is in Hawaii, and it's very competitive. Every year, Around 1,900 people compete against each other in front of thousands of spectators. Okay, so you know the final is in Hawaii and they compete against many competitors. Yes, okay. So number one, are you there at home? I am not going to put again, to play it again. At home, you rewind it and play it again if you need a repetition. Is it clear? Yes, okay, let's check. Okay, so uh, number one, you know, it says, what sport is it? Well, there are three kinds of sports there, okay? You know, you have swimming, yes, you have running, swimming, running, and cycling, all right? Yes, and the most important thing is that it is in open water. It isn't in a swimming pool, all right? Yes? Good. Uh, it's called Ironman. Yes, okay. Um, and they compete against different uh, swimmers. Okay, number one from the listening. Okay, one, three, two. They swim 3.86 kilometers and cycle 1.8 kilometers. Okay, number three, around 1,000. Yes, 900 people compete. Yes. Okay, 1,900 people compete. Yes, okay, good. Uh, I want you to go very quickly to number four. Are you there? Yes, okay, go to number four. Yes, okay. Pause in this part. Do number four because I'm going to dictate the answers now very quickly. But at home, you need to pause. I'm not going to wait here, yes, because I'm recording the classes. Okay, good. Did you finish number four? Okay, did you finish number four? Okay, so number one, competitor. Number one, competitor. Number two, compete. Number three, competition. Number four, competitive. You know, from one word, you have many words. It says competition, the noun, competitor, another noun, Yes, competitive, competitive, yes, the adjective, all right, is it clear? Page 22, remember, when I say go to exercise 4, you pause it, and then you listen to the answers, all right? Is it clear how we are going to organize? Good, very good. Okay, let's go to exercise 20, page 22, okay, exercise 1, okay? Good, Danny. <laughs> Can you read the statement? Yeah. Okay. Well, why do you think the competitions are crazy? Why do you think the competitions are crazy? Yes, these kind of competitions are crazy. Because you have to do a lot. Because you have to train for many hours. Why? This is your opinion, yes? Speak at home, yes? Okay. So, uh, I want to... Um, which competitions is a race between different teams and which is a match between two teams okay so i want you to read yes to do exercise three okay number two 
number three, number four, number five, and number six. From page 22. Two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, are you there? Yes? Yes or no? Okay. Mm -hmm. Are you there? Ready for the answers? Okay. Why do you think it's crazy? Yes? Okay, because, uh, for example, these, because they have to run, yes, with a shopping cart, for example. Did you see the picture? This is a crazy competition, yes? Okay, this kind of crazy championships, okay? Good. Well, are you there? Exercise two, yes? A race between different teams, yeah, teams, yes, the idiotarot, a match between two teams, the mad ball championship, yes, okay, that was the answer, okay, exercise three, one A, two B, three A, four A, five balls, Okay? And 6B. Yes? Now, I want you to go to exercise 5. Yes? Okay? And you know you have the words in the text. You have the words in the text on page 22 highlighted. You have race, teams. Yes? You know what, are, what teams are. Boca Juniors, River Play. Yes? Independiente. Yes, then you have players, match, winners, and goals, yes? Most goals at the end of 60 minutes, yes? Goal! That is a goal, yes? Okay, number five, yes? Are you there? Okay, remember to do exercise five, pause, and then listen to the answers, okay? I will give the answers now. Number one, race. Number two, players. Number three, teams. Number four, match. Number five, goals. Number six, line. And number seven, winner. Okay, good. Exercise six, are you there? Okay, good. So number one, long distance running races. For example, marathons. Yes. Cycle races. For example, the Tour de France. Yes? Okay. Swimming races. Yes. You have the freestyle also. Yes, in the races. Yes, car races. The Grand Prix, for example, the Formula, Formula Uno. Yes. Okay. And horse races, for example, the Derby. Yes. Okay. Um, number two. Football. Yes. Okay. Basketball, rugby, ice hockey, volleyball, yes. Number three, yes, your answers, okay, this is yours. Number four, you score goals in football, rugby, but only by kicking the ball through the post, yes. Remember, in rugby, you score a goal by kicking the ball through, yes, um, the post, tienen los dos postes en rugby, yes? Hockey, handball, water polo, and you score points in basketball, yes? Two points for the basket, yes? Rugby union, five points for a try, yes? You remember the try in rugby, three points for a penalty or drop goal, and two points for a conversion, okay? Cada uno ya sabe el deporte que practica, yes? Okay? Badminton, tennis, volleyball, American football, six points for a touchdown, three points for a field goal, and one point for a touchdown conversion, okay? Well, exercise seven, yes, let's go to page 23, yes, and there we go. I want you to highlight, yes, the grammar chart, as we always do in the class, and you have the must, you have can't, don't have to, mustn't and can't, yeah, good, yeah. yes, remember when you have the moral verbs, it means can't, can't, must, mustn't, 
should, shouldn't. The verb, yes, you have a modal verb, yes, plus the infinitive. Esto ya lo sabemos desde tercer grado, ¿ok? Yes, so I must go, I should study, yes, I don't have to study, yes, because I don't have homework, yes. Can you pick up that pencil on the floor, on the floor? for example, yes? Is it clear? You already know. So, highlight the grammar chart and do exercise 7, yes? Do exercise 7. Remember to do the exercise, pause, and then listen to the answers, okay? I will say the answer. Number one, must have to. Number two, to, can, three, don't have to. Four, mustn't and can't. Okay? Are you ready? Yes? Exercise seven. Is it clear? Yes? Good. All right. So I want you to go very, very quickly to exercise eight. Can you go to exercise eight? Yes? Are you there? Okay. Do exercise eight, please. Okay, answers, are you there? Have to, two, mustn't, three, can, four, must, five, can, six, has to, seven, don't have to. Is it clear? Yes? Good? All right. Shall we go to exercise nine? Yes. Again, complete with more verbs. Yes, are you there? I will give you the answers. Remember to do the exercises, pause, and then listen to the answers. All right? One, must. Two, have. Three, can't. Four, can. Five, don't have to. All right? Yes? Good. So I want you to go to the speaking part there and you're going to explain at home. We have already done this in, a, in other courses, yes? But you have to choose uh, one popular, choose one popular uh, sport from your country and I want you to explain it, how you must play it, yes, which are the rules, yes, okay? And you have to make a list at home of six or seven rules, yes, on how we practice this. And you have the example. Is it popular? Is it a popular sport in your country? Uh, you know, uh, are there competitions, national or international competitions? Yes, for example, it says here, baseball is a popular sport in my country. You have to play with two teams, a ball and a bat, yes? Remember to use more verbs. You have to, ta ta ta. You must, ta ta ta. You must kick the ball. Yes. Okay. Is it clear? All right. So I want you to go very, very quickly to the last page from today, and it's page 24. Okay. And you have the suffix, suffixes, suffixes there. Yes. The word building. Yes, I want you to highlight the chart on page 24. You already know how we work. Yes, okay. And you have football. You have the word here. Can you see? Yes, this is a noun. And you add the ER and you make another noun. Yes, football and footballer is the person who plays football. Is it clear? Yes, and this is the chart about. You have the golf, and if you add ER, yes, golfer, another noun. You have the word compose. What does it mean, compose? It's a verb, a noun, or an adjective? It's a verb. And if I put the, the R, it's composer. Yes, from uh, a noun. You have another noun. From a verb, you have a noun. 
All right? Is it clear? Yes? Okay? Cycle is a verb. And if you put like this, this is a verb. And then you have cyclist. You add these words and it becomes another word. Is it clear? Yes? All right? Yes? You have play. And tell me, which is uh, the noun? Yes, player. Yeah? All right. Is it clear? Yes? So I want you very quickly, yes, very quickly, to do exercise two. Come on. Are you there? Yes? Exercise two from there. And we're going to finish with the listening. Is it clear? All right. Do it. While you are doing this, I'm cleaning the board. <coughs> okay, are you there in number two? Boxer, monocyclist, baseball player, swimmer, you know, from swim, you have swimmer. Remember that you must add another M. For example, remember you have swim, Swimmer. Okay? So you have consonante, vocal. Duplico la consonante. Is it clear? Swimmer. Yes. Eso de second grade. Yes? Okay? Good. Chess player. Six. Racing driver. And surfer. Yes? Gymnast. Perdón. And surfer. Yes? Okay, are you there? Yes. And I want you to uh, go to number one. Yes. It says uh, sport people in the photos who are, it says I don't like losing, bolt. Yes. Okay. I am very competitive. And then Lionel Messi, you can't win all the time. Yeah, this is true. Okay, number one is bolt. Number two, Jessica Ennis. Yes, okay. And what well, you have, Lionel. Yes, and you have Venus William. You know, the two sisters that are tennis players. Yes, okay. Uh, they all want to be number one. They are number one. Yes, but you can always. What Lionel Messi says is very true. Okay, um, that's all for today. Yes, okay. So remember to do speaking at home. Yes, talk about the famous people there. Famous people, sorry, there. Yes, and how they do to win. What are the things they must do to win? Yes, they must train every day. Yes, they must eat healthy. Yes, okay. And all the things they must do. Yes, okay. And what things? They live behind to be uh, famous and to be the first in the world. Yes? Okay? Good. So the class of today, yes, finished. But at home, remember to do pages 12, 13, 14, 15 from the activity book. Yes? Okay? You don't have any homework in the Google Classroom. Yes? Okay? So I will pass the today pages and I will pass the homework in there, in the Google Classroom, okay? All right? But you don't have any homework that you have to hand in, yes, uh, in the classroom, okay? Only just read and see the class. Remember, I always put a video of the class plus the summary what I write here, okay? Bye-bye, see you next class.